Yeah. We did it, y'all. We gotta come back in the morning. I know, right? The we do. Coming back in the morning, it'd be the worst, girl. It is early. And I don't like the time change. I like to stay in my time zone. Me too. Here you go, thank you. All right. Oh, this is your bag. You sure? She will come out. <laughs> no. No, that's mine. I'm about to say. All right, y'all. Thank you. Have a good night. <laughs> They will knock at your door, yes. Really? Yes. Did you hear what he was and trying to tell me? What are you saying? He was trying to say that I had to call Scott up to get a shovel. I'm like, no. Yeah, like, it's already scheduled. What are you talking about? You give me a... <laughs> she, I can't believe she got out at that point. I shut the back door when she come back there. You got it? Well, you know. Now. Y'all, why they give me this hearing impaired room? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it may be, it may be a corner office. Just Chanel here. Quick telly tour. I got the handicap room, so let's see what it's looking like. Nice mirror here. Hello, it's me. <laughs> um, let's see. So, with these types of trips, I shower before I get to work. This would be a problem if it was a regular layover, cause like what? But um, I shower before and then just after, cause I'm only gone for about nine or ten hours. This is just spacious. So, okay. The counter drop is low, but that's okay. We can we can handle it. And I'm, I see, I told I told y'all it's gonna be like a little corner office. I am ready for bed. Got my do rag on and a t-shirt. Um, it is currently 12:21, and pickup is at 4:20. So I have exactly four hours until pickup. Um, I am going to set an alarm. Typically. Pickup is not at 420, usually it's between 430 and 445 on these types of trips, or like sometimes if you're lucky, 450. But um, our departure is at like 530 in the morning, so that's why it's a little bit earlier. Let's see, I'm gonna set my, so my earliest 4 a.m. alarm is for 407, so that's a good time, because then you know how you gotta break down your alarms. 407, if I hit snooze, I'll be able to sleep till like 4.15, then that gives me like five minutes to get ready and one minute to get downstairs. Hmm. But I have to vlog. So we're going to set an alarm for, I guess, four o'clock. Ooh, I need to set, I need to keep this alarm set for four. This one, the song is All My Life. I'm grinding all my life. Sacrifice, hustle, pay the price. <laughs> Um, I like that. I have different alarm, like different songs for all of my alarms, and I have quite a few alarms. <laughs> so, yeah. I guess it's not as many as some people, because some of y'all be having an alarm every 30 minutes, and that's crazy. Okay, anyway, I'm going to go to sleep now, because obviously I only have, I'm getting a solid, what, I'll get a solid three hours of sleep before I'm probably gonna wake up in the middle of the night and be like did I miss pick up because that happens all the time but um it's like I'm t I'm a little bit tired but I'm just gonna try not to get on my phone because that's how you end up up until 1 2 o'clock in the morning so I'll catch you guys in the morning I put my blackberries in lemon uh, for my tea in the refrigerator I was gonna say don't let me forget it but Let's hope I don't forget that. Oh, it's dark, dark up in here. It is time to go. I have like one minute to get downstairs. I didn't forget my lemon and stuff. they did to my galley I don't know what this means but I have restocked the carts last night so I didn't have to do any work <laughs> tonight so I'm hoping that 
it's the same part. So I don't know if they replaced everything or what. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, hold on. Let me check this one. Yeah, they did. They did cater to people, girl. We and they gave us dry ice, which means I gotta break out this hammer. Um, let's see. Where is it? Oh, I had the snacks ready and everything. I should have left a note. Have a good day. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, done with the flight. We're out of here. Have a good one. Our gate is literally right here at the flight attendant lounge, so super convenient because this is where I can get on the bus to go back to my car, like to the parking lot. The manager had texted me yesterday and mentioned, good morning. Yeah. My manager texted me yesterday and um, one second. So she mentioned that my anniversary pin came in. So I hit five years like earlier this year and we get a pin I think for the first year and then every five years or something like that. Um, so I'm gonna see if she's here so I can grab it. Oh yeah, that'd be great. I don't know how much should I, I don't know how long. My name is Chanel Blackful. That's my Instagram too. I've literally been sitting here for like 30 minutes just getting a bunch of stuff done because I don't want to drive and like do too much. Um, I'm actually going to start uploading my video. But I got my anniversary pins. I'm going to show y'all that. I'm excited about it. Um, just gonna, what is my schedule on Monday? Oof. I can swap. Uh. Here is my five year anniversary pin, y'all. Like, <laughs> so cute. I'm about to put this on my uniforms. Um, I'll probably actually keep it in my bag, and so that way I'll take it on and off um, as I fly, you know? But yes, it just looks so good when you have like your wings and then like your flight leader bar and a pin. You can do like a Black Lives Matter pin or one of your anniversary pins. I have my one year anniversary pin, but it's like put up um, in my like little travel box. So anyway, let's upload this video. Yes, I'm just getting all the love today. I've talked to like so many people while I'm sitting here. I'm like, yeah. Oh, and I made a reel. I was like, I know I was doing something. Let me show you all the reel real quick. Go to my Instagram. Well, did I make it? Oh yeah, I was doing the caption. I was like, wait, where did the where did the reel go? I'll just tell y'all the rough draft. <laughs> and while the streets calling your name, the airport calling mine. <laughs> Wait, a bar taco lunch here. I got a rice bowl too. And then I gotta go get the kids and still make one more stop. Get into the material. Now, y'all know I don't really eat pork, but pork belly here, child. So, look how they garnish it. Like, usually they kind of mix the veggies, the peppers and stuff anyway. This is so pretty how they plated it. The last errand of the day, I went to go look at a, um, yeah, new a new place, y'all, because I don't know if I mentioned this in any of the vlogs, but I am moving very soon. Look at this box, y'all. Isn't it so beautiful? Like, oh, oh my goodness, so cute. This is for the fall lifestyle box. Get yours now. Quality time is the physical sense. You can physically be here, but mentally. We just took a little power nap, didn't we? We took a power nap because I'm tired, you know. All right. Come on. And where are your jazz shoes? I want to move. These are a few of my favorite things. Do, 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 do. I mean, your hair looks so cute. <laughs> the kids are trying to tell me that. 
these are a few of my favorite things is Ariana Grande Seven Rings. I don't think they realize this is from a whole soundtrack. It's sound not. Of music. It is. They're like it's kids' bop. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens, bright copper kettles and warm woolen mittens, brown <laughs> paper packages oh, yeah. tied yeah. up with strings. These, these are, are a few of my favorite things. It's seven rings. No, it's called my favorite thing. Cream color. It is pizza night. <laughs> it's kind of close, girl. And I am headed out. Y'all, ain't no way. This the same 20s that our parents had. It's just no way, bro. <laughs> Did they work this much? I got my Air Force Ones on going out to the car because I left my work shoes in the car because I had to change at my second job from my first job. And then I had to change back after taking my shower and everything. So I'm headed back to the workplace. <laughs> and so after that, I just want a nice vibey. Wow, that person just ran the whole light. This is actually my first favorite plane, y'all. I used to fly this um, when I was based in Minneapolis. And those that don't know, I was first based. Let me turn this around so y'all can see, see me. Okay. I was first based in Minneapolis when I started um, as a flight attendant. Y'all, it's my hair. I gotta do it. I still, still getting it together here. I was early to work though, so I got so much time. Uh, but yeah, this is my favorite plane. It's the Boeing 757. I like it a lot because you're in the when you're in the back. So senior mama status again. If you watched the last daily vlog, you saw that um, I was like the most senior person on the trip. But I like this aircraft because I have the entire galley to myself, um, and you know I just have my own space, so I can kind of organize. And it's a really big galley as well, so that's nice. Um, and then there's also seats for everybody. So even though there's two flight attendants at like the boarding door in the middle, um, they have two jump seats here that they can sit in um, like when we're done with the service and everything. So everybody is able to be in the back together. There's seats for everyone. It's comfortable, it's spacious. I just like to organize it really. That's kind of why I like it. But we are headed somewhere in Florida. The captain said that there is a horrible storm, so the weather is going to be horrible the entire way, which means basically it's a deadhead. <laughs> so more than likely, we're not gonna do the service. Um, the When I worked last night on the way to wherever we went, the, the, uh, the flight was really turbulent for like the first hour. This flight's only an hour. Um, so we already kind of are pressed for time and this aircraft is a little bit on the larger side. Uh, so I'm not even going to start setting up the carts yet because I'm one to work smart, not hard. I'm not going to waste my time. If he said it's going to be bumpy, then I'm not going to do all this work and we may not even do the service. However, where y'all are sitting right now, there is, is an empty, there's supposed to be one of these right here. So I need to grab my work phone and send a message and let them know that we're missing one of those because there's certain things that we cannot leave without and <laughs> this is one of them here i don't know if y'all can see that hold on there we go missing carrier a415 and there's a new reply and open up this one this is our provisioning kit 
and this is kind of like all of the needed supplies. We have extra napkins and trash bags and things. So this is something that we definitely will use, even if we don't use, do the service, especially gloves we use during the boarding process to like close overhead bins and everything. So I like to put all the gloves and hand sandy wipes in one bag just so that it's convenient. I take them all out of here. And then also the trash bags, we'll go ahead and put in the back. You guys can see there's some from the last flight here, but we can put some more back there just so that, you know, we always have trash bags available. Um, I think that's kind of all we'll need for now. We have recycle bags as well, but that'll depend on if we do the service or not. And then this top carrier just has all of the Starbucks coffee. Did I mention I brought the crew some good old, I have so much in here, quality. I brought them um, some pineapple raspberry rosé. So, boom. And then, sorry, I'm trying to find the camera. <laughs> and then also, I have like a bunch of, oh my goodness, my love that love is falling, hold on. I also brought them some BYOB bags. These little baggies, well not these bags, but the BYOB bags, so you can like bag your own tea, go in these just to keep it protected. And you know what, I need to come up with a crew tea. Like how I have those little samples, I don't plan to do like the little samples of uh, tea like that unless we're featuring something for the season but having that as like the standard crew tea would be really dope because hello like i could have it in the lounge and the more that it's visible you know your girl can try to get on the plane near you yeah look what i found i've never seen these before they're called trip wipes now i don't know if that's the actual brand that is partnered with the airline but i just opened this carrier because i was trying to find headphones and i saw that it said headsets i don't but they're not in here obviously um but trip wipes like isn't this so cool i've literally never seen this look at oh thank you have you seen these before i have i keep seeing them everywhere they keep putting them in the bathrooms Oh, is it a bathroom thing? Well, I don't know, but I saw them. Thank you for that. You're welcome. So a lot, there are a lot of them on international flights. Oh, okay. Seen, but now I've seen them infiltrating domestic, so. Oh. I'm like, I've never seen these yeah. before. I'm gonna yeah. put some in my bag. I realized I did not take my vitamins this morning, so I just took them. always keep some in my bag just in case I'm not home forget to take them before I leave home so yeah that was to me I take ritual vitamins y'all there's a few things that are always in my description box one is ritual vitamins two is the Nama juicer that I use all the time and three is such hair so those three things are staples I need to go ahead and just add base in there can, can I get a link <laughs> but no seriously um, check out ritual if you don't take a vitamin every day you need to they have vitamins for men women teens and children they also offer a protein powder which is absolutely delicious but you know it just makes sure that you're getting all of your nutrients and they taste amazing i mean it's a pill but there's a essence tab in every bottle so y'all see like that clear tab right there so there's an essence tab in every bottle and it keeps your vitamins really fresh and then it also gives them like a either citrusy or minty flavor so you don't get that like vomit nastiness that comes with taking vitamins check out the link in the description box so you can save 15 dollars on your first month it's literally less than a dollar a day y'all so super affordable delivered straight to your door every month and if you're missing anything in your diet you know any essential nutrients this will replenish that and just make sure that you are on top of your health and wellness getting everything that your body needs because we gotta stay youthful okay we ain't working all these jobs making all this money for no reason we want to live long <laughs> This is definitely one of every flight attendant's favorite hotels. The destination is super close. It's me looking like yesterday, <laughs> or actually this morning. Y'all, I cannot believe it's almost one o'clock in the morning. I've been up since four o'clock in the morning. So I've been up for what, 24 hours? I mean, I can't count. 21 hours, is that right? Yeah, 21 hours. But anyway, let's get into the room. Um, one thing we all love about this room is that it's hardwood floors, so 
it's cleaner um, you know all the dust and gunk that carpet holds of course there is a rug but just the hardwood floors you know it just makes everything a little bit more airy it has a nice beach vibe to it the bed is really always comfortable uh, and yeah y'all saw like the water tray on the bed and everything it has this like wardrobe that's nice so even if you have a really long way over here which we don't but if you had a really long way over like our pilots I think they're here for two nights um, this is just a great place to you know hang up your layover clothes your workout clothes whatever you want to do and there's another full-length mirror in the wardrobe right here and then of course you have your television I usually always use a luggage rack but I find that when I work these overnight trips, I just put my bag is smaller than like my regular crew bag. So I typically will just put it um, on a hard surface. So today it's the refrigerator. Um, at other hotels, I may put it on the desk. And then this is the bathroom. One of everyone's favorite parts. This room should have a balcony and it would like set it off. But I just hung my uniform up here. I mean, let's get into the material. We have another base bag. I use this for flight attendant life only because I'm literally able to fit every single item that I need to get ready for my days uh, in here. So I keep like dental hygiene products here, any skincare and body care here. This is not even full. So I'll also have, um, I usually have like my mascara in here. The necessary odorant i can fit their body serum in here as well um you guys can see i have my foreo products i mean i have eye mask back here i can fit a lot in this pocket and this one is actually removable so you can set it right here on the counter if you like and then there's even two pockets in the back that um, i like to sometimes use for the foreo products if the uh the pouch is completely full that's like a really good spot for that those items and then here at the bottom i keep my hair items and just like seasonal uh, get ready with me hygiene personal care items so i have a clip i also have my sunscreen on here because technically it is still summer so this is a full time a full size sunscreen i have my soap bag and um carrying case and then a bottle of the wrinkle release spray, a shower cap. I keep a hand soap, like a little mini bottle of hand soap in here. And then also, I don't know if y'all can see, but there's a lint roller. And then I have an extra toothbrush. So, yes, I mean, we got we gotta go ahead and just sit and base the content. But anyway, okay, the bathroom. Because <laughs> I didn't even get into that for real. This is the shower. Everyone absolutely loves the shower. It's huge, okay? Like, it's really big. It's giving just like coastal. Basically, you can shake off here, like if you were sandy, because technically we're at the beach and it just gives you enough room to really get clean. And then this is what the rest of the restroom looks like. It's just well lit countertop area is really big and i think everybody enjoys the design of the hotel the people are nice the food is decent they give you coffee in the morning you know it's just flight attendant stream over here so i'm actually going to oh you know what before i move that i usually take this out and i always put a hand towel on the um countertop i don't like to put anything directly on the counter but i'm gonna take a photo because it's giving a little bit of a thumbnail here it's been real thank y'all so much for watching i really appreciate you all tuning into the daily vlog by the time you see this video the deal of the day is a free gold tea infuser ball we have not had this product since last year okay 2021 and y'all it will sell out there's a limited quantity there's only 200 of them I'm just gonna give you all the numbers there's 200 of them the last time we did this deal was on a friday night and we sold out in a few hours so as soon as you watch this you go place an order on the site any order no minimum is required you will notice the free infuser ball will be added to your cart at the checkout process um, of course get your fall lifestyle box the box is absolutely gorgeous you'll probably see me rocking the hoodie over the weekend a spice color hoodie over the weekend and um, I finally get to enjoy some tea time at home tomorrow because I don't have the kids so 
Joy, I'm going to get my three hours of sleep and I will catch you in tomorrow's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.